This is Tanya. Now, Tanya is a mother on the verge of a nervous breakdown. You see, backstage is her 14-year-old daughter, Shanti. In total, 14-year-old Shanti admits to having sex with over 10 guys. <laughs> and besides that, she's smoking pot, she's drinking, she's been over 100 fist fights. And there are more statistics. Two sexually transmitted diseases. But Shanti says she's all grown up. You know why? Because she has a one-year-old son named Shaquan. That's right. Shanti had a baby at 13. Having that child has not stopped Shanti's uncontrollable ways. Watch. I'm 14 years old, I had a one-year-old baby, and I'm a grown-ass woman. So what if I had a baby at 12 who's still gonna smoke weed, drink, and have sex? I admit, I don't know who the father of my son is, but I don't care. When I want to kick it with my friends, I make my mom watch the baby. If I'm sleeping and the baby try to wake me up, I'm still gonna go back to sleep. If my baby needs food or he need to be changed, I make my mom do it. I am so sick of people telling me not to get my baby Kool-Aid. I do what I want. I've been in a hundred fights. If you try to mess with me, I beat your ass too. Wow. Tough girl. So, you found your little girl pregnant at 13. I mean, what'd you do? Well, I took her What was your reaction? I found out on my birthday. No. She didn't know who the father is. No. Do you know who the father is? No, I don't know who the father is. I had two people tested already. And Twice already. <laughs> two. They weren't the fathers. No, they ain't. How many the could there be out there? It's a possibility of 10. <laughs> I mean, this is a little baby. This is your grandbaby. She flip about that child too? Yeah, she thinks he's a toy. When, when, when he starts crying, it's here, mommy, here, get the baby. She feeds him Kool-Aid and not milk? Yeah, he's, he's thirsty. She, she makes him Kool-Aid. I have to make sure that he gets his milk. I got to make sure that his diapers change. He's bathed. Everything. So He's my baby. He's not hers, actually. I didn't do these things to my mom when I was growing up, and I'll be damned if she's gonna keep doing it to me. Talking about your mom, how does she treat your mom? My mom told her to come home, and she was around her friends. She hit my mom. She hit your mother. She hurt her own grandmother. Yeah, she left a bruise on her chest. What'd you do about that? I beat her ass. The rumors in the neighborhood is that she's the neighborhood. I don't know if anybody know what the is, but they call it a neighborhood whore. If you want a free time and you want to go to Shanti. How about those STDs? Yeah, she had chlamydia twice. And um, <laughs> my biggest fear for Shanti is is that she's going to contract HIV or AIDS or herpes, something she can't get rid of. That's my biggest fear in this world is that my daughter is going to die because she she wants to continue sleeping around unprotected. This is what she had to say. Mom, I'm sick of you telling me what to do and it's going to stop today. Ain't nothing stopping. I'll run the show. Here's Shanti. Shanti, come on out. Here she goes. something you know what shanti this is when i think whatever stop whatever stop at 12 years old when you got pregnant that's when whatever stop you take care of your child yep you do yep shanti shanti you love your mom yeah huh yeah 
You love your grandmother? Yep. Why'd you hit your grandmother? Because she hit me. You ever hit your mother? Nope. And I bet you you won't. <laughs> Shanti, you know, you gave up the right to have a certain kind of life when you had that child. No, no, I didn't. But you don't seem to remember that. Mm -hmm. You like to go out and party now? Yep. Do you take that child of when you go party? Yep. You do? Yeah. When you go into the park and that child gets mosquito bites all over it. Whatever. What are you doing in whatever. the park? What I'm playing at the park just like him, so whatever. 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 Do you have any idea who the father of your child is? Nope. No. Yeah. Yeah. What happened? Where did you get the idea, Shanti, that Kool-Aid was just as good as milk? So he can eat Kool-Aid. He can drink Kool-Aid. I don't got to feed him milk all the freaking time. Whatever. I don't got to feed him milk. Oh, well, take care of your own children. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I've never known anybody who's able to take care of a child and smoke pot every day. So the pot ain't gonna kill me, so I ain't doing nothing wrong. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Shut up. Y'all got no life. Shut up. No, won't you shut up? Whatever. I love that. And until you decide to stop Shut with up. your little dis disastrous ways, I will continue taking care of Shaquan. But it still ain't exempting you from being a mother, because I'm going to make you be one whether you like it or not. Whatever. Whatever. Because I didn't lay down and get him. You did. Shanti, let's look into the future. Where, where do you see you and your son in five years? I see my son with me in, in the future. Years. Whatever we doing. Whatever we doing. Well, we'll see about that. Whatever. We'll be back right after this.